Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are doing another Primark haul. Now I just want to say thank you so so much for all the love I had on my last Primark haul. I'm nearly at like 11k views on it, I've never had a video have that many views. So I just want to say thank you so so much for the support and the love, like honestly it's, it's amazing. Right, let's get on with it anyway. I actually have got so much again. So I'm going to go in with a smaller bag first. I actually went into Primark not too long ago and I saw this bag and I really wanted it but I just didn't get it because I think I was like it was towards the end of the month coming up to pay there and I'd already picked up some things so I went back the other day it was half price so I was like are you kidding me it's not dog tooth actually for some reason I thought it was dog tooth it's checkered and it's in like a soft material um, and it's got a double chain it kind of reminds me a little bit of like the Chanel bags that are in style right now but I just thought how nice for like work or if you're wearing black or blazers. It's got like a little twist buckle and then inside it's actually got quite a lot of room for like books. You know, all your work stuff, planners, anything like that. Really. This was £12 reduced to £6. And they also had it in the backpack version. And that is also in the sale for £6 at the moment. I was tempted to get the backpack version. But I stuck to this because I really like the double handle star bag at the moment. Guys, you know, the colour, sky blue. You know me, every haul, if I don't buy something that's sky blue or sage green, it's not Primark haul by me, is it? So I picked up this beanie. Guess how much it was, guys? A pound. Literally a pound. They've got loads of like the winter glove scarves hats in the sale at the moment. Like there's loads of reductions with the winter stuff because I think they're trying to move to the spring and summer. Like they've, they've even got bikinis in there now. So I just thought this was so cute. Just for a pound, literally. Definitely go with some of my like jackets, jumpers that are light blue. Talking about the gloves and all of that on sale. I also picked up these. I didn't even realise they were actual real leather. Okay, so these were £10, these gloves. And I just love them because they've got the cotton inside. So I just feel like they look so stylish. They were £10 and they've been reduced to £5. They also have them in the brown leather colour as well. I actually think I prefer the brown one. Turtle necks absolutely obsessed these are the thinner ones now if you watch my last primark haul which was like a week ago you'll see that i picked up the like maroon colored big thick high roll neck jumpers that they've got in they're a bit more expensive i think they're like 10 pounds these are the thinner turtlenecks that they've got as well and these are only six pounds so i picked this up in a large and it's just a cream color but i just thought underneath like if you've got nude blazers um, or just underneath some shackets and stuff tucked into jeans this will just be so nice and easy and really easy to style now guys it wouldn't be one of my hauls would it if i didn't have a positivity t-shirt or something in it so this is a hoodie and it says manifest 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 now everybody knows I'm like the queen of manifesting. I wanted to pick this hoodie up before because I'd seen it. Um, they've also got the matching tracksuit bottoms as well, but I didn't really want it as a tracksuit. I just thought if I'm like lounging around the house or running some errands or I really can't be bothered to wear something nice, this hoodie will just be so easy to shove on with some jeans or leggings. I got it in a large and it is seven pounds. I like getting things in a large now just to have that oversized baggy feeling that I'm into but it is just a lovely cream colour I'm really loving the pastel um, writing on it as well I feel like I'm going to wear it and then like if I'm feeling a bit blare or if my mind goes a bit black for a minute I'm going to look in the mirror and I'm going to see manifest, manifest, manifest you literally cannot forget to manifest that again so I wasn't too sure about this but then I tried it on and I quite liked the look of it on I really love dog tooth and this is like a brown and cream dog tooth crop it's, uh, I don't know what the material is. I'm, at the moment, I'm a bit like, ugh, with crop tops, but I'm like, Jess, get out of here because you're gonna lose some weight and you're gonna look great in it. Um, This was in a size 16. It was, I think it was reduced before to seven pounds and now it was reduced to four pounds. I thought, because I'm a big bust, I, I'm like bigger on top. So I thought, let me just try it out and it did fit. And I just thought it'd be so nice because of the colour. I've bought loads of creams, nudes, browns lately. So I just feel like I could really style this up. I'm going to be honest, guys. I feel like me and the universe were like this at the moment. I really wanted this coat when I went in the other day. And it was £30. I think it was 30 or £25. And I was a bit like, mm, I really want it. But I couldn't justify it at the time. 
I went back, it was 15 pounds guys. This coat was 15 pounds. Like it is just so nice. I'm gonna obviously insert the clips where I'm trying it on because you'll see it better. But it's nude and it's just, it's actually dog tooth I think close up. It's dog tooth, it's got like, oh look at the sleeves, look at the detail, the ball buttons down the sides. It's got pockets guys, are they real? They're real pockets, oh my god it's got real pockets. And I just think it's so classy, it's that colour again, I've bought loads of things lately, like I'm loving nudes, that nude palette, so I feel like I can style it off. I got this in a 10, now I'm not going to lie guys, I have quite bigger arms and it's a little bit tight on my arms. Really could have done with a 12 but they didn't have a 12, but in my one they only had like 8 and 10s left so... I'm forcing my way into it basically. Also, I've done my makeup all with Primark product. I've just filmed the video for it. I'm gonna edit the video. I think it'll be up after this video. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out that video. It's gonna be full face of Primark makeup. Also guys, do you remember this jumper from my Primark haul a week ago? I thought you guys were gonna like make fun of me about it, but actually everyone was like, I love the jumper, so. I thought I'd wear it for this haul. I really wanted some belt and I thought why not get a sky blue belt to kind of go with the pastel -y colours I've been buying lately. So I got this in the size medium and this was only £3 and it's just a really thin belt but I just thought so nice. Instead of wearing just my black belt all the time, because the jeans I bought from Primark previously have been so good, I thought I'm going to get another pair of jeans. These are high waist skinny, they're only £10 and they're in a size 14 but I love the colour like a really really dark blue because i've got like new black boots i just feel like they go really well with it but i, I do think it's important to have different color jeans because like jeans can really make an outfit and i feel like if you have different style jeans i feel like i'm just trying to justify it i'm just trying to justify buying more jeans but yeah in love again i know this is like the third time i've said it the color scheme of like the nudes creams all of that i saw these trousers now these are like bootleg would you say i'd say they're like bootleg trousers um does it say on here actually vintage slim straight high waist so they're high waisted i got these in a size 14 they're 15 pounds all the shackets that i bought where i've got like light colors i've got some more clothes coming for a haul that i'm doing with another company you'll see soon i just feel like these will go really well with some of the items I just think it's a little bit different as well i feel like i wear so much dark clothes and I don't just want to wear dark clothes all the time I'm trying to introduce like colour into my wardrobe as you can see and I'm really enjoying it so far okay so talking about colour this is bright okay I feel like if you liked this jumper that I got on now and my stuff in the last haul you're probably gonna like this this is just I just I was drawn to it I was drawn to the colours like the fuchsia pinks and the bright oranges i just feel like if you wore this walking down the street people are gonna be like oh okay i got a size large and this is 15 pounds again i really liked the oversized feel and i can roll up the sleeves and stuff if i wanted to it doesn't feel like it's going to be that itchy material it's really soft it doesn't feel irritant um, this certainly isn't irritating so I'd like to think that this jumper is going to be okay as well attention this is my second favorite thing I bought in the haul so it's a shacket and it's like cream yellow and bit like baby blue that sky blue color that I always seem to buy I got it in the size 12 and this is 15 pounds this is actually quite a long shacket though it's like just over your bum I just love the color scheme with it even I feel like those creamy jeans that i've just bought will go with we'll just go under this and maybe like a plain t-shirt underneath or that cream um turtleneck i just feel like it can be a really nice bright happy outfit guys happy outfit the last bag is all beauty stuff so beauty and like accessories i picked up these earrings because i just thought they're so nice like i love these ones here these um Oh, is it broke? Is it broke? No, it's not broke. It was just closed. I really love like these ones here. And then I just love these like little dainty earrings. And then they've got some like plain ones here. And I can probably put these in some of my other um, earring calls as well. I mean, I probably can't put it in my day. I've got a day here, but it's still healing. I want to get one of those like sun jewelry um, pieces, like 
it's, I don't know how to explain it, like a, I'm gonna put a picture, so in there, so it's pretty. And then I got my um, tragus and I've got my helix, so I could probably use like my hips, one of these like plain hoops in my helix. I really wanna get like a rock and a snug as well. I need to find like a really good jewelry place to get some really nice jewelry from my earrings. Primark, they don't usually have a lot of like tester perfumes out because people just nick them. Um, which is so crazy to me, but they had a test of perfume out for this um, for this particular perfume, so I managed to get to smell it. Now, they obviously look like a dupe for the Jo Malones, which I think they're supposed to be. So this is Rose Oud, and I actually managed to smell it, and I was like, oh, I need to get that. But that's actually quite a lot of, that's, what's that, more than 100 mil? Oh, that's, that's 100 mil. You're getting 100 mil there. So I don't know how long this will like last on the clothes, but I just really liked the smell of it. I just thought the smell was actually quite nice and refreshing. It's very floral if you like, like florally smells. So that was eight pounds. I just really liked the smell of it. I think they do have another one as well, but I haven't smelled the other, um, the other scents. So if you have smelled the other scents that they do with these, let me know and tell me if they're worth getting. Like I mentioned, I did a Primark makeup look just using primer products because so some of these i've used in my video that i'm about to put up probably after this video so i won't go into too much detail but i picked up the ps prime for life primer mist i got this in the reduce section for two pounds i've used it to spray my face after my makeup today and um to spray my makeup brushes when doing my eyeshadow for more pigment i also picked up a blusher from there this is in the color carnival and this was only a pound yeah so don't forget to watch that video so you can see how pigmented or not pigmented the products are so like i was saying me and the universe are like this how i managed to get hold of this i have no idea i managed to pick up one of the foundation and contour sticks this was one left hidden somewhere how i seen it i don't know don't ask me i really wanted to get one because i really wanted to do my contour with it however i only managed to get a color in porcelain so i've used it i've used it under my eyes i really want to get the darker one to do like my bronzer with it so i was just really happy to be honest managing to get one of these i think they're two pound fifty these are primark gods you really really do need to stock this product bag and also stop bringing out so many good products i've got no money another thing i did buy is the concealer stick for 90p this in the color chestnut this is um something i bought to do my contour with to try that out i also sent these for a pound um they were only two pounds anyway which i think is crazy the fact that they were only two pounds anyway just some sunglasses i really need sunglasses for driving at the moment because the glaze from the sun is so crazy but yeah i thought as well for holiday because the prices will go up on sunglasses and stuff when the summer comes so if i get a couple of sunglasses behind me i'll be ready i also got the brow pomade and this is in the color dark brown obviously it's been used for the makeup video so I got that, that's £2.50, try it. And then I also picked up the eye pencil. This is in the colour bronze and it was a pound. It's close up, it's quite metallic. I don't think the camera will pick that up, but it's quite a metallic colour. So we'll see what that is like for my eyes. I didn't want to try like a brown eyeliner, but they didn't have a brown one there, so I just picked up the bronze. I've also picked up a eyeshadow palette. This is £2 and this is the eyeshadow palette Flame. You've got six on the pan there. Um, and they're quite, they're quite nice colours to be fair, I really like this um, metallic-y, orangey, brown, burnt, like a burnt orange colour. But yeah, very warm colours if you're into warm colours. They do have like blues and other different colours there as well, like cooler tones. So there is a lot of actual eyeshadow palettes at Primark. And then the last thing I bought for a pound was the Awaken Lemongrass Energising and Awakens Essential, 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 essential oil oh my god i feel like i'm trying to talk really fast because everyone everyone was on my case about babbling so much in my videos now i'm trying to talk fast i can't speak i got essential oil because i've actually been sent a humidifier by carepod and i really want to put some essential oil in it just to sort of like see how strong the smell is to make the house smell nice so i really can't wait to try that guys wow well, that is it I feel like I've tried to be as quick as I can for you. I've tried not to babble, but 
I really, really hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you love the pieces as much as I do. I honestly think Primark are banging it out at the moment. They are literally, their stuff is so amazing right now. Loving the pastels, the shackets, everything. Like, they're just doing the most. But honestly, you're taking my money, Primark. You're making me skin. So, it's like a love-hate relationship, me and Primark. Honestly, you would think I'd be sponsored by Primark by the amount of hauls that I do for this flipping company. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and comment. Let me know if you enjoyed any of the products or let me know if you're gonna pick anything up or that you've seen that's amazing. And then also guys, follow me on Instagram and the Instagram is just Jessica, Jessica X. So I'll see you on there. So honestly guys, thank you so, so much for all the love and appreciation. I just honestly really appreciate all your support. So I hope you have a lovely day. Thank you for watching. Bye, have a beautiful time.